Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Nicole, of course. If you guys are new here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also, make sure you click that notification bell to get notified every single time that I post here on my channel. Today, you guys, there has been a lot going on. I want to just first things first say happy Friday. I am really, really excited that it is the weekend. I do have big plans for tonight, which we will get into a little bit later into the video but we have a lot going on i am going to be doing a five guys mukbang and then i wanted to order i'm sorry i wanted to open um something that was sent to me in my p.o box so first things first let's go ahead and get everything unpacked i took some extra utensils and um mustard ketchup all that kind of stuff so i can keep it in my car so that i have it you know whenever I do my mukbangs in here. So we got some, I got some hot sauce on the side, but I have Cajun fries, which you guys know, you guys know how Five Guys is. They kind of just throw it into the bag. I like that, I do and don't like it. Like, you know, cause I don't know, it's fine. Um, they smell delicious. And then I also got a, cheeseburger now I couldn't even tell you the last time I had a cheeseburger but I did zhuzh it up and get um, a lot of stuff on it so let's go ahead and I'm gonna dump some of the fries out just so that my car doesn't get so messy but the bottom is filled with fries so if we run out in the cup we have some more in the bag but let's see here Mm. I'm gonna just put this off to the side Na -na. okay so basically I got a cheeseburger with fried onions pickles mustard ketchup lettuce tomatoes onion I already said and then tomatoes I don't know if I said that already but I'm sorry guys it is six o'clock here and I am hungry I've been running around all day so Let's go ahead and get a thumbnail and die, pray and dive in because I need a few bites before I tell you about this day I have been having. <laughs> it's not too bad. Like, I'm not complaining. It's just been really busy. So, let's get a quick thumbnail. Okay, that's good enough. And let's pray and we can dive in. So, Father God, I want to thank you for this food. And please bless this food. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, guys. It's time to dive in. Did I say that I have Cajun fries? Mmm. Mmm. These are good. Mm-hmm. Wow. I didn't even know they had Cajun fries. Mm. Okay. Let's take a bite together if you guys are eating with me. So cheers. Happy Friday, everyone. Have a blast. Be safe. Get home safe, but still have some fun. Make some TikToks, make some YouTube videos, all of that. Instagram stories. Mm. Mm. This is so dang good. Okay, so this guy in front of me, I don't know if he's crashed. Oh, never mind. Okay. He looks like he's crashed into the pole, but he's in line for Chick-fil-A. That explains it. The line is like almost out to the street right now. <laughs> mm. This is my first time eating anything today, so... I mean, give me a second to 
F things up <laughs> and then we can get started here. <clears throat> I like mayonnaise with my fries. I know I must have said that on Dalvin's channel, but I don't know if I've ever said it on here. My channel. So I'm going to say it again. <sighs> Is that odd? My mom does it, and then she taught me. She was like, just try it. And I was like, okay. And I like it. I like the taste of it, so... I think it's really good. Mm mm mm. Okay, one more bite and then I will talk to you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love you all. Okay, so. Lots of stuff that I have to tell you guys about <clears throat> or get into. So today I actually filmed my new Fashion Nova haul, which I ordered all pink items that will be coming out very, very soon. So look out for that. This was probably one of my favorite Fashion Nova hauls. I did also just pick, uh, take a picture and posted one of the outfits on my Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, go ahead and do so. It is at Nicole, of course. Um, it is the picture of me in that pink skirt and then the tie-up top with the butterflies on it. So, so cute. Mmm. I'm gonna have to breathe back in my car after this mukbang. <laughs> but so that pretty much took a lot of my day up because sometimes if I don't like something that I said or whatever, I um, restarted and all of that. So I did that. And then I went grocery shopping because my camera needed to charge in order for me to do this video. to all these and I haven't been to one down here yet in, in Houston I was like you know what I typically go to Kroger's I was like let me try out all these I haven't been one in Texas so let me go try it out mind you don't go grocery like if you're not a fan of people or being around a crowd or whatever it's not the best idea to go grocery shopping on a Friday at like five o'clock because everyone is there but besides that um, I'm looking around I have my list and I'm trying to get all the items that I need I was planning on making some monster cookies tonight that's my big plans monster cookies and sipping some wine possibly possibly either recording it or going live possibly okay just putting that out there it may or may not happen um but i did get all the ingredients for me to make to make them so basically if you have never heard of monster cookies excuse me monster cookies before it is um i made them in high school because i was in cooking class <laughs> and um It's peanut butter, oats, chocolate chips, M&M's, 
and then like baking soda baking powder all of that vanilla extract flour um salt did i say peanut butter already all that kind of stuff but it's just like all combined into one and they're so good they're so so good and i haven't i just thought of them the other night i don't know why they popped in my head but um they did so i was like you know what it would be really cute if i recorded it or went live or something like i said i want to start going live a lot more with you guys um which someone told me about like going live on youtube and i don't know how to do that but I was gonna maybe do it on my Instagram or nah, probably not TikTok. Most likely Instagram so I can interact with you guys and stuff like that. So I think that'll be really fun. And then have, I did grab some wine. Um, I think it's pink Moscato, maybe something else. I don't know, but so the main issue was, hold on. <laughs> So I didn't just go there for the ingredients for the cookies. I wanted to do a bunch of cooking videos this weekend and um, use that Cajun spice that I picked up at in New Orleans. I have another idea. So stay tuned for all of that. But mind you, this was the first time I've been to all these in Houston. It was the closest one to me. And I'm going around, <clears throat> this is like my second time going around, and I didn't see this celery like at all whatsoever. I'm clearly blind because I went around twice and I couldn't, well, one time and then I went back around. And an employee was like stocking the shelves or whatever for the produce. And I was like, hey, do you guys have like um, celery? And she was like, ma'am, it's right there. I was like, listen I don't have the time or the patience not at all I haven't ate today I, it's not it for me it's a no for me and that's literally what I said in my head I was like it's a no it's a no for me like no we're not doing this right now because I can't I was like oh, okay thank you so I got over that I found the vanilla and everything else the baking stuff then I go to the checkout and the cashier didn't speak not one word she was like she's just bringing up all this stuff ding 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 she's like she said whatever the total was eighty dollars da 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 and i was like okay and then just dead silent like don't aren't you supposed to say like oh have a nice day or hello welcome people like there wasn't a lot of people in line it was just me and this other lady i don't know maybe it's just me but <clears throat> I couldn't do it. I was like, never again. I'm not going to this one never again. Like, mm -mm. I can't do it. Other than that, my day was pretty productive. Got a lot of stuff done. Definitely check out my Fashion Nova haul one that drops. I got some really cute clothes and purses this time so that's exciting i'm gonna end my night off baking cookies with a glass of wine and just chilling i really want to stay home this weekend i don't want to do anything um because i was you know just in florida then i'm not complaining i have i had a blast but I thought that I can keep going and keep going. I was like, okay, after this, I want to do this and this and this. I guess it turns out I'm really not that person. Like, I can do it, but I need some time at home first alone. Gather my thoughts. And, you know, just, I don't know. I am a homebody a lot of the time. I do go out once in a while, but... <sighs> <clears throat> um, 
I actually got asked to go to Milwaukee next weekend. And I was like, you know what? Should I do it? But, mind you, I am going to Milwaukee in August for at least two weeks. Possibly longer. So, I think I'm going to just chill out this whole month until whenever I leave to. I haven't set the date, the dates that I'm going in August to Milwaukee, but we'll see. <clears throat> um, I'm really, really trying to make my mom's gifts this year really cute and playful. I have to, you know, pack them all in my suitcase and then wrap them there. So, I've just been picking up things here and there. Um, I got her a lot of stuff in Florida. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, K collect Favorite Collections just sent me that cute cup to give to her that said Moo on the side. If you haven't watched that video, go watch it now or after watching this one. <laughs> This is so dang good. But I want to just chill and bake and clean my house. You should see my beauty room right now. It's destroyed. <laughs> Every time I do a fashion overhaul, it's just everywhere. It looks like a tornado hit my beauty room. Like, it's so bad. <laughs> also I just thought of this when I was going to get the food the guy at the register was like because <clears throat> I sat down because there was like a not that long of a wait but he was like okay we'll call your number I was like okay so I got my soda filled and then I um I was just waiting playing on my phone I, actually I was posting that picture <clears throat> of the outfit in Fashion Nova and I was so deep into my phone. I didn't hear a number being called at all whatsoever. But in a distance, like ever so lightly, I just hear, ma'am, ma'am, your order. And I'm like, I finally like catch it because I'm so into my phone. And I was, I turned around, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I guess I was too deep into my phone. He was like, that's fine. I was like, I am so, so sorry. Like, I find that very, very rude. Like, don't get me wrong. But, I was listening for a number, not someone saying, you know. But either way, he was so nice. He understood. Actually, can we just get into, like... <laughs> I'm sorry, but I was literally thinking about this the other day and I was starting to write it down in my notes on my phone. How many pet peeves do you guys actually have? Because I feel like I have a whole list and it may sound crazy. That's just who I am, but I'm going to name off a couple. Um, uh, yeah. Whatever. You're going to get to know me, all right? Basically, I cannot stand when someone whistles. It literally just... <laughs> it sets me off to a whole, like, oh my gosh, it really gets on my last nerve when someone whistles like not like at a game like like with using their fingers but just like walking through a store like or in the cars oh my gosh it drives me insane when someone whistles in the car but you know something like that i don't know what it is but i really cannot stand it <laughs> this whole video is just gonna go into like my things that nicole can't stand 
and listen if you don't like it or have something rude to say in the comments whatever of course you're gonna say it anyways but you said I was born in the last one so let's make it interesting let's give you something to talk about right not to all my true supporters i love you guys always but <clears throat> okay i'm just gonna say one more and then we can get to opening this po package but i find it the absolute like worst when someone is on their phone and you're spending time with them like ugh. that's probably my number one thing or in a car and they're just always like constantly driving and looking at their phone like I can't do it driving looking at the phone but even like some of my friends back home will be like hanging out or whatever but they're always doing something on their phone I'm like can we not can we like I'm the type to put up my phone when I'm around somebody spending quality time because it, it's I just can't especially this what I'm about to say can set me off until the next year when they're on their phone and I say something to them and they totally ignore you or after like a couple seconds later then they answer I will not ever speak to you again well not like that but like I will not I just know I'm just like cool I'll leave whatever like mmm So those are my pet peeves. Comment down below what is yours. <laughs> Cause I would love to know. I always wanna know what pe people, other people's pet peeves are. Cause maybe mine are just absolutely insane. And that's okay, but that that's not even the, begin of, the beginning of it. Like I have literally so many. So let me know what yours are because I would actually, like I'm very interested in knowing Mm -hmm. I really want to know like is it something as stupid as whistling I feel like the phone thing is kind of common mm -hmm. but definitely let me know okay I'm almost done and we can open this package. Mm. It is Friday. I feel like everyone's Either they're all going home or I don't know what they're doing, but there's a lot of people out today. I'm done. <clears throat> Let me just put this up. I need a little whatever. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. 
I'm gonna open something from my P.O. box, which I'm really excited. <clears throat> By the way, I just wanna say thank you. I know I say this all the time, but thank you for um, sending me anything to my P.O. box. I really, really appreciate it. You don't ever have to. Don't feel like you do. Um, I just appreciate even if you leave a comment, I'm thank you so much. Okay, so this says Claws ATL <gasps> Luxury Press on Nail Kit. Ah! And I just took off my nails. Funny thing, I just put on some like Kiss glue on nails, and they literally, I put them on this morning, they literally all popped off. They were like this gorgeous purple. They're gone. All of them are gone. So, let's see, claws. Oh my goodness, I'm really excited. Ah, so I see some marbled color nails in the pa The little packaging is so cute. I don't know if you guys can like totally see them. Ah, blue nails. And they have like a little Chanel, I'm sorry, a little Chanel logo on there and then some <gasps> diamonds. So cute and they're like a gorgeous blue color. And then this thing looks like a, is it like a sponge? I'll have to read, there's like a little thing in there I have to read about it. Okay, so. First of all, your business card is so, so cute, which I don't see a name. So it's just the, the, the name of the company, Claws ATL. And then her business card, it looks like a little credit card. That is so cute. I absolutely love that so much. Like it literally looks like a card. That is so cute. Ballad through forever. It is luxury press on nails. This is so cute. You can follow her on Instagram at Claws Nails <clears throat> Claws Nails ATL and then www.clawsatl.com. And then to contact her, like email, it's contact at clawsatl.com. All right, it's all on the bottom. So, if you ever want to get something, order for something from her, which you absolutely should because these nails are so, so cute, take a screenshot or just look back on this video. I will have it linked down below in the description box so you can go check out her Instagram. There's a couple more things in here. Ooh, a pair of white, a white set. That's pretty, thank you. I actually need nails and then some glue. So I'm gonna be putting these on soon. I wanna wait a couple of days because I just took them off. When I did the press-ons, I cut them because they were like as long as this that you gave me. Um, but they were little, like little short nails and they still just popped off. My glue might have been bad, I don't know, but girl. <clears throat> that's it but she has some really cute like little I want to say confetti but you know it's just some cute packaging in there so I'm so excited uh, thank you thank you so so much I really can't wait to glue these on um, these are great for when you're in a pinch and you're in between like getting your nails done and kind of not because you can always pop them off and reuse them which well I do um, I don't know about how many other people do that but I'll, oh, these aren't just white nails. This has a Chanel logo on it too. <gasps> They're black and white. Oh my gosh, I have to show you guys this. Hold on. These are really pretty. I'm gonna have to get, <clears throat> no, you sent me glue. Let me see. Let me see if I can get out the one with the design. Okay, so some of them have the little rhinestones on there. And then, sorry guys, my camera, um, it was, yeah. 
<laughs> it's shut off but um my guess is i would put like the rhinestones on either the pointer and then the chanel on my ring finger which i thought i dumped it out but it's not here <clears throat> Let's see. Oh no, I lost one. I'll have to get that later. Okay, here it is. This is so cute. Look at that. Don't look at my ugly nails, but <laughs> the Chanel logo. So I would put this or yeah, I'd probably put this on my ring finger and then the other bedazzled one like on my pointer or just switch it up however you want to do it. But these are so cute. Let me just show you. Since I showed you these, I'll show you the blue ones. I don't want to lose any more. But yeah, these are great when you're in a pinch. And you don't have time to make a nail appointment or you're going out tonight and you don't have no nails on. Like a me. Well, I'm not going out tonight, but if I was. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so these... Did more than one yeah so these come with more than one that has a little um diamond on there right on the bottom and then some have oh, come on i know i've seen it <laughs> the little chanel logo in white i can't find it here it is okay see this is so cute Yay! How pretty and the color is gorgeous. Thank you so much. I can't wait to glue these on. Yes, I'm singing my words again. <laughs> All right. Well, since I showed you those, I have to show you the marble ones, right? I'm just showing you guys the designs that she does have. I'm sure she has many more, but these are just some options. So make sure you definitely hit her up and go support her business. Now these are all the same. It's like a marble um, look, which I love these two. You see them? Cute. All right. So yeah, let me know how your Friday's going and what your pet peeves are down in the comment section. Keep me entertained for tonight. Um, I may or may not see you guys on live. Uh, I'm not gonna, well, here's the thing. I'm not gonna make the cookies if I'm not, like, if I don't make the cookies tonight and go live or do a video, then I'll do it tomorrow. Cause I definitely wanna film it either way. Um, we'll just see what goes on. So you'll get something. But in all reality, I have been having my full face and hair done all day. And typically, I know I'm like ranting a little bit, but typically I'll do my hair and makeup, film a video, and then take it off right away just so that my face can breathe. Um, so I don't know how much longer I can wear my makeup on my face because sometimes I just want to itch it. And so you guys know what I mean, hopefully hopefully you understand so we'll see if i'm going to do the live tonight i should have said that in the beginning either live or video tonight or tomorrow night so stay tuned for that please comment down below please go like and follow my instagram at nicole of course and on snapchat twitter tiktok and facebook it's nicole of course with two e's at the end i love you guys happy friday i will see you tomorrow bye